The Guppy Multiple Moving Average Trading Strategy. Hey guys welcome back to another episode, in this video we will be going through our very simple yet profitable scalping, intraday, and swing trading strategy that no one ever told you. This video provides a clear, winning, step-by-step -step guide to how to successfully trade in the markets and generate consistent profits. So, by the time you finish this video, you'll know exactly when to enter high probability trade using the, the Guppy Multiple Moving Average Indicators. If you want more videos more often please smash the like button, subscribe, and turn on the notifications bell, so that you know exactly when new content is released. A very important point before we start. Everything we discuss in this video can be used for currency trading, stock trading, and crypto, because price action stays relatively consistent across different assets, so we're going to go very in-depth in this video. The Guppy Multiple Moving Average Trading Strategy The Guppy Multiple Moving Average, or GMMA indicator, provides an interesting approach using moving average ribbons. As a trend trader, it's not enough to just identify the direction of a trend and catch the trend. Trend trading success depends not only properly identifying the trend direction and catching the trend after it has started, but also on getting out as soon as possible after the trend has reversed. If you find yourself struggling with any of the above, you might want to take a look at the Guppy Multiple Moving Average Indicator. The Guppy Multiple Moving Average, or GMMA, also known simply known as Guppy, is a technical indicator that identifies changes in trends, which means it provides you with an objective method to know when to get in and when to get out of a trade. On a chart, it looks like this. The Guppy was created by an Australian trader named Daryl Guppy. Hence, the name of the indicator. Daryl introduced the Guppy Multiple Moving Average, or GMMA in his book, Trend Trading. The Guppy is a trend-following technique composed of 12 EMAs, or exponential moving averages. The multiple lines of the Guppy help traders see the strength or weakness in a trend better than if only using one, or two EMAs. The 12 EMAs are separated into two groups. First, a short-term group of EMAs. Second, a long-term group of EMAs. Each group contains six moving averages. In this chart, the two groups of EMA are differentiated by color. The long-term group is green, while the short-term group is red. The trend is determined by the long-term EMAs, signals are given by the short-term EMAs. The Basic Rules of Guppy Indicator You would enter a trade when a trend reversal occurs, which is indicated when one group crosses over the other group. First, when the short-term group crosses above the longer-term group, buy. Second, when the short-term group crosses below the longer-term group, sell. How to set up the Guppy Multiple Moving Average This technique consists of combining two groups of exponential moving averages with differing time periods, or lengths. The 12 periods used are 3, 5, 8, 10, 12, 15. 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, and 60. The 3, 5, 8, 10, 12, and 15 exponential moving averages are used to show the short-term trends momentum. The 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, and 60 exponential moving averages show the longer-term trends momentum. Now, let's show both groups of EMAs on the chart. You can see in this chart, trend reversals and continuations can be identified with these two groups of EMAs. This should be simple enough. Or, in this video, I've included a template with the system that you can simply upload to your chart, and it will automatically plot all these indicators perfectly on your charts, so there's nothing for you to worry about. Get the download link on the description. How to use the Guppy Multiple Moving Average the Guppy Multiple Moving Average can be used to identify changes in trend direction or gauge the strength of the current trend. How to identify trend strength The degree of separation between the short and long-term moving averages can be used as an indicator of trend strength. If there's a wide separation, this indicates that the prevailing trend is strong. If there's a narrow separation or lines that intertwine, this indicates a weakening trend or a period of consolidation. How to Identify Trend Reversals 
The crossover of the short and long-term moving averages represents trend reversals. If the short-term EMAs cross above the long-term moving averages, this is known as a bullish crossover and indicates that a bullish reversal has occurred. If the short-term EMAs cross below the longer-term ones, this is known as a bearish crossover and indicates that a bearish reversal is occurring. How to identify a lack of trend? When the moving averages between the two groups are close together and approximately parallel, it indicates that the short-term market sentiment and long-term trend are largely in agreement. Basically, when both groups of EMAs are moving horizontally, or mostly moving sideways and heavily intertwined, it means the price lacks a trend. Looking at this chart, notice how when the red and blue group of EMAs are intertwined, price is directionless, simply moving up and down within a range. This current price action is more suitable for range trading. As a trend trader, it would make sense to sit out and wait for better conditions. Just remember this phrase, when the market is sideways, trend traders sit on the sidelines. How to trade the market with the guppy multiple moving average? The GMMA indicator can be used for trade signals. Buy signals. When all short-term EMA cross above all the long-term EMAs, a new bullish trend is confirmed and triggers a buy signal. During a strong uptrend, when the short-term moving averages move back toward the longer-term moving averages, but do not cross, and then start to move back higher, this signals another continuation of the bullish trend, and triggers a buy signal. Also, after a crossover, if prices fall back and then bounces off from the longer-term EMAs, this signals a continuation of the bullish trend, and triggers a buy signal. Sell signals. When all short-term EMAs cross below all the long-term EMA, this indicates a new bearish trend and triggers a sell signal. During a strong downtrend, when the short-term moving averages move back toward the longer-term moving averages but do not cross and then start to move lower, this signals a continuation of the bearish trend and triggers a sell signal. Also, after a bearish crossover, if the price rises but then bounces off from the long-term EMAs, this signals a continuation of the bearish trend and triggers a sell signal. No signal. The buy and sell signals above should be avoided when the price and the EMAs are moving sideways. Following a consolidation period, wait for a crossover and separation. If there is no trend, this indicator will not work. GMMA Compression Breakout Strategy the moving averages also act as support and resistance levels. When compression of both groups of moving averages occurs on the same candlestick, this could indicate an overall trend change. Here's the trade setup. First, look for a candlestick in which the high and low pierce through all 12 moving averages. Second, place a buy stop order above the high and sell stop order below the low of the candlestick. Third, once filled, make the opposite stop order that wasn't filled, your initial stop loss level. According to our opinion, the Guppy Multiple Moving Average GMMA, is highly reliable for various trading strategies, including scalping, intraday, and swing trading. Here are other examples the Guppy Multiple Moving Average or GMMA trading to fully understand this wonderful strategy and to make the most out of it.
The Guffey Multiple Moving Average is a trend-following system. Trading with the trend helps you win more than lose. The Guppy can help you visualize both scenarios of either a trend reversal or a trend continuation. Although a simple indicator, the Guppy system only works best when the price is in a clear trend. As always, if you learn something new, or if you want more videos more often, make sure you subscribe, click the notification bell, and share this video across your WhatsApp, Facebook accounts, or Twitter to show your support. See you next time.